Hello, Dot2 users. This is Spencer at ACT Lighting. Today I want to talk to you about the programmer versus the executor and what the difference is. So when I think about the programmer, I like to think of these preset types over here. The programmer is kind of a medium that allows the user, us, to manipulate our fixtures and create a look on stage. Um, the programmer interprets this information and outputs it uh, via DMX to the fixtures so that we get that look on stage. Okay, so if I were to select these fixtures and bring them to full, um, I notice that I get a little red tick mark here next to my preset type telling me that that information is now active. Okay, if I looked at the sheet view of the fixture sheet, um, we see our selection and we see a red background on our dimmer. Maybe I want to go into color, give myself cyan, go into gobo, give myself a gobo. Now I have active information in the programmer. That means that my programmer is currently holding on to this information and outputting it to stage. Now maybe I want to recall this look later on. So I can store this to an executor. Right? So when I hit store, the programmer looks at all active information and says, okay, this is what the user wants to save to the executor. And now I can just tap on a blank executor. And if I clear my programmer, that is the information that becomes recalled into the programmer. Okay, that's what's being output on stage. So the difference is the programmer, it's live. Um, we put in this information here, whereas the executor is where we can store and recall that information. Okay. There's also a cool feature um, in this magic button. It allows us to manipulate executor time versus program time. So if I enabled executor time, um, that means that this queue will now be overwritten with this timing. So if I hit go, it's going to take five seconds to load in that queue. The same can be done with program time. So if I turn this off and enable program time, give myself five seconds. Anything that I put into the programmer will now take five seconds to be output on stage. So maybe I want to dim these fixtures out. So I could select them, say at zero, please. And now on stage, it will take five seconds for these fixtures to go out to zero. So it's pretty cool. You can use the programmer to punt live shows. You um, want to think of the programmer as the place to go to start recording cues to your executors for later on playback. All right, that's all I have for you today about programmer versus executor. If you have additional questions, always feel free to email us at support at actlighting.com. Also, check out our other articles at the support um, page on our website.